So Samsung is going to showcase its new flagships for 2018, uh, which is supposed to be the Galaxy S9. Uh, it's supposed to be debuting on February 25th, which is actually tomorrow, is according to when you are watching this video. So what should you expect? Let's find out from the rumor mill. So what's supposed to be new in this phone, which is rumored to be called the Galaxy S9. Uh, let's start off with the processor. The processor is going to be the Snapdragon uh, 845 SoC, which is standard. Like we expect the change from the 835, uh, which the Galaxy S8 and also S8 and S8 Plus and the Note 8 also had. Uh, this processor is going to be more efficient and going to give you much better battery life and a lot more features which are added on into the processor itself. Uh, Samsung also has a variant of the Exynos processor which is the 9810 which can only be sold outside the US. Battery wise, uh, the S9 is supposed to have a 3000 mAh battery and the S9 Plus is supposed to be having a 3500 mAh battery which is quite similar to what the S8 and the S8 Plus had. Uh, but because the processor is more efficient, maybe the battery life might be much better. Also, the RAM on the Galaxy S9 uh, is supposed to be around 6 GB, which is similar to the Note 8. Uh, but you have new uh, storage options other than the 64 uh, GB. You have now 128 GB and it's rumored to also have 256 GB. The S8 and the S8 Plus also had a micro SD card slot, which also might continue on in the S9 and the S9 Plus. The size of the screen is going to be similar to the S8 and the S8 Plus which is uh, around 5.8 inches and 6.2 inches. But one major change uh, is going to be the fingerprint sensor. People didn't like that the fingerprint sensor was right next to the camera because you kept smudging the camera up every time you tried to unlock your phone. And uh, keeping it under the uh, sensor, away from the sensor, uh, it's actually going to keep your uh, camera sensor cleaner and it's going to be much more easier to reach. Security has been also improved on the Galaxy S9 uh, and the S9 Plus by a uh, faster iris scanner and also it's going to be using a combination of the uh, iris scanner and facial recognition to bring in much more robust uh, security to the phone. The biggest change that even Samsung is actually marketing is the camera. The camera is supposed to be having a variable aperture which is f2.4 and f1.5. The uh, larger aperture or that is the f1.5 will actually allow for better low light photos. Dual camera is rumored to be only on the S9 Plus which is the bigger variant of the S9. Also super slow motion at 960 fps which has been uh, teased in the trailers or the teasers that have been released by Samsung. Uh, but we are not, I'm not sure if it's going to be 1080p, I think it will be mostly at 720p. Oh, and the dual cameras are going to be positioned vertically, unlike that on the Note 8. 3D emojis also might come out in the Galaxy S9 and the S9 Plus. So I'm pretty excited with what Samsung might bring out uh, tomorrow. I just hope that they're going to surprise me with something new which I have never expected. To watch the unpacked event, I'll be providing the links below. Make sure to like this video and also subscribe to the channel. Also make sure to click on the notification bell to be informed when new videos are added. Thank you for watching.